reaching our destination and Russell is getting more sweaty bum yes sweaty bum sweaty bum sweaty sweaty bum bum so we're getting nervous now now I can feel it how are you feeling Russell? I'm nervous I feel like it's pooping pooping, <laughs> pooping his pants and I feel like I want a wig <laughs> We are now inside, waiting for our induction, so we've done our check-in. Okay, just a uh, just, uh, waiting game now. <laughs> Time to wait. Yeah. Hi guys! Good morning! Welcome, welcome again! It's our day three of our Salisbury holiday. Salisbury holiday. <laughs> he said, of our holiday. So today I'm preparing our breakfast in which I will have coffee and Russell will have his tea as usual. And we will just be having light breakfast today because our activity today is you will see later. If you're very sensitive it's not advisable to eat a lot so we'll just be having a um, light breakfast as we'll be eating frosties for cereal and then the kettle oh i forgot to turn it on stupid okay where are the bowls russell is here he's finally out of the bed and he's turning on the lights just continue watching our video and you our activity today. Are you ready? I am ready. Are you I'm ready loving... for our activity? Yes, which is uh, unloading the dishwasher. <laughs> Hope you enjoy and don't forget to like so you can see more unloading in the dishwasher. <laughs> it's so good. That's why I love him so much. I'm having breakfast alone because uh, Russell's in the toilet, so I'll be eating first. We need to leave by quarter past nine because we have to be there by 10 o'clock for the check-in. Um, as of now, I'm not feeling anything. I'm not feeling afraid or anxious, but probably later when we get to the venue, I might be shaking and hopefully I won't pass out during the activity. So we'll see. Just watch the video. We might create a separate video for that so just um, click the notification button so you will know when it's posted okay hello hello just checking emails not emails so they must be coming through his text message which is pretty worrying because we might get phone signal okay. did you put the milk away yeah mm, what do i have for my <laughs> <laughs> then this is what happens when you leave someone to make my breakfast. <laughs> you can't even make a bowl of cereal. Aye! It's an observation! Mm -hmm. 
reaching our destination and Russell is getting more sweaty bum yes sweaty bum sweaty bum sweaty sweaty bum bum so, 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 so. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, we're getting nervous now uh, I can feel it and that's uh, where we're going there's the plane it's getting we're getting ready but the sky is still dark oh my gosh I can see people going they look so happy and excited unlike us so we arrive at 9.49 we are now at the uh, old at the, uh, how are you feeling Russell? I'm nervous, I feel like it's pooping pooping, pooping his hands and I feel like I want to wee I've been going to the toilet I've been to the toilet oh. twice already this morning <laughs> time. Yes. time we need to go because it's 10 o'clock our check-in time so we'll see you later keep watching and oh my gosh we <laughs> just left <laughs> bye <laughs> I need a wee. <laughs> so we'll just have to check in. Yeah. 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 Ooh, welcome guys. Um, Thank you. So you got emailed a little code yeah. that you're going to take into the third new sign for the check-in window. Into the door there, plug that code into the iPad. You stay inside the reception, uh, you'll see it. Go to the reception, speak to the lady, Mike George. And then take a bit more information and then they'll explain the rest from there. Yep, no problem. Do you mind if I do temperature checks? Uh, so the world has changed a little bit, so while you're indoors, please, masks on. Yeah. Uh, the toilets are just in the door beyond the check-in. There's a diner down at the bottom. Um, once you're seated and once, when you're outside, you're welcome to take the mask. Yep. And just relax because everything's quite socially distanced. But yep. otherwise, head on in and have okay. fun. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Thank you. I'm going to check in. Oh, the after the induction, the final check, and that's the kitting up. And this is where we get ready. Jumpers only at this point, and that's the plane. At the moment, it's on hold. Reception. Oh yeah, check in. We are now inside waiting for our induction. So we've done our check-in, paid our remaining outstanding balance. outstanding balance, and yeah. After the induction, they're gonna get us ready to yeah. jump off. The <laughs> yeah, so we've got our box here. So we just continue watching. So only the two of us here. So. Yes. As it says, are you ready for the ultimate adrenaline rush? No. no. <laughs> I need to be, oh my god. How are you feeling? Done the induction, so we're just waiting. I'm okay, just uh, <laughs> just a uh, waiting game now. <laughs> I need to wait. Yeah, I've gone to the loo, so I'm feeling good now. Yes. Yeah. So I'm going to show you the field. People are waiting for their turn. That's the plane. We haven't started yet. We're just waiting for the weather to get a little bit better. We're waiting for our names to be called for kitting up. So as of the moment, we're just chilling. Russell is nervous. He's just not showing it to you, but he is nervous. He's got a sweaty bum bum, <laughs> even though it's cold. I didn't expect I'm gonna wear my jumper, but oh well. The nothing epic. It's raining now. So we have to wait a little bit longer. Into Salisbury Town City because 
Yum Yum wants a fridge magnet. We haven't done our jump yet because no, of the weather. The, the weather. So instead of 10 o'clock, um, it was moved a little bit later. Probably around 2 to 2 3, or three o'clock. 3 o'clock. As of the moment, Most it's raining. So they might start jumping two or three hours. We won't because we're there's a group in front of us, so we probably have. To, we might end up waiting till like four or five o'clock before we can jump, yeah. which is another four or five hours. Mm -hmm. Anyway, we'll just be enjoying our time here oh. in where? Salisbury. Salisbury. So we'll see what we can get. Going, Russell? No, no way. I'm waiting for you. Okay. So we'll just uh, roam around, see what's in this place. I'm hungry, actually. It doesn't want to eat. Nothing much. So the shop we walked into. We're going back to the street. Most of the shops are closed. Probably because it's Sunday. Oh. We're going to the garden. Sure, mm. looking for food now. There's nothing much to do but eat. We'll eat and eat. Food stall. Lunch is served. Uh, our lunch for today. We got sausage, uh, Angus burger, and chips, of course. And he's got his drinks. Hello. Ready to eat? I don't know if you can see it, but there they are. Yes, and we are heading that direction. As I said to the instructor, amazing, mm -hmm. two thumbs up, which I wasn't sure I could do that when I was skydiving, it was more... <laughs> yeah, yeah. It was so cold up there. Yes, my eyes were watering. Feeling sick actually. Mm, I'm so so, but After apart from the my... flipping and flopping. Apart from my hearing, one of my ears feels blocked. So we've done it. Yes, we are done alive. It. We survived. We landed safely. And thank you so much for our instructor. And uh, just watch our video from Go Skydive. Um, uh, it's going to be uploaded in a separate video. So please watch it, like, and subscribe. You don't forget to click on that notification bell. Yes, yes. We're just um, going back to the car. So We're going to go nice. back to our cottage. Nice relaxing cup of tea. Yeah. Maybe a bit of cake. It was funny because we've just finished eating and then they phone us that uh, they're ready for us. So we're literally full when we went for skydiving. <laughs> <laughs> I'm feeling sick. Yeah. 
Well, that's, it. that's done for today. We had fun. Hi guys! Hello, hello! Good morning! So this is our last day of our holiday. And Russell is now crying because we're going home. Aww. We're just preparing our breakfast and we're getting our stuff ready. We need to check out at 10 o'clock, exactly 10. It's an, And it's already 9 o'clock in the morning. So, yeah. Uh, we have packed up all of our things last night. Most of our things last night. Just bits and pieces that we need to do this morning. He's there preparing our breakfast as always. Um, what can you say about our holiday? It was nice. We needed it after everything that's happened. It's just a shame it was short, short. Yeah. It was an amazing holiday with all the activities that we've done. It's not like a lot. We're, we've just done two activities so far. We have done a lot. We did all day. We went to the museum. Mm -hmm. Then we walked around the house at Bewley. Looked at the gardens. So that was nice. Overall, it was nice. Mm -hmm. I enjoyed it. Yeah, and then yesterday we did the big activity. Watching Yum Yum get pushed out of a plane. Yeah, it was scary, but I want to do it again because I was not able to do the hard thing. No. No. She just uh, mm -hmm. looked like a fur. Anyway, we need to get ready as soon as possible. So, back to reality again. Russell will be working tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, I need to pack up when we get home, get ready because I need to go back to the Philippines. Or something important. Alright, we've just checked out from our accommodation and we are now on our way home back to Sepanem. We're just gonna do a little bit of recap of our holiday here in New Forest. So you can start, Russell. So, yeah, we stayed at a lovely uh, accommodation. Oh, what are you doing, little TV? <laughs> you got us lost yesterday, now you're interrupting us. You're fired. <laughs> Um, yeah, so we stayed at uh, the place called The Barn at High Forest Cottages, which you see the link below. Mm -hmm. It was very nice, very quaint, it had a log fire, um, mezzanine, beds, it was lovely. The only thing is, if you're over six foot, be careful of the beams, because it has low beams. Yeah. But apart from that, it was lovely. It was beautiful, had a modern kitchen, lovely bathroom with a bath and shower everything was clean I highly recommend staying there they have mm -hmm. other cottages on site so mm -hmm. you see the link below yeah it's a lovely bar we enjoyed our stay there it was cozy it's relaxing yeah the three uh, things we wish we could have had which there wasn't was a microwave mm -hmm. well that's everyone's taste whether they use a microwave or not but microwave would have been nice yeah. um, storage in the bedroom department mm -hmm. we thought there could have been some more little cupboards just to put a few bits and pieces in if you're six foot plus the beams you'd have to keep ducking for which would be annoying that would have been it for us it would have been perfect but apart from that it was still highly recommended and we would go back again mm -hmm. yeah. and then Saturday we went out we went to National Motor Museum. In where, Yum Yum? Bewley. We did the house as well. Yeah. Uh, the gardens, which was very, very nice. Mm -hmm. It was a nice day out, not too expensive. Yeah. So if you're coming here in the New Forest. New Forest, so these are just some of the things to do. And of course, our highlight for this um, holiday is the skydiving. That's in Old Sarum, Salisbury, if I pronounce it correctly. Because <laughs> uh, he always corrects me when I pronounce it. And also, one thing I enjoyed here in New Forest um, is seeing wild animals. They're just roaming around, even High Street and Beauty. I saw a donkey outside the store. <laughs> He's probably thinking of buying something, but he just couldn't get in. We also saw horses, um, I was thinking of buying cars, 
So yeah, it was fun seeing all these animals roaming around, not in the cage, not being locked up. Anything else you can add up? Apart from, unfortunately, all holidays have to come to an end. So we're going to miss the new forest yep. and every little thing with it. But overall, we will definitely come back. Mm -hmm. Yes. And we love you. Thank you so much for watching our video for today. Remember to like, subscribe, and click the notification bell. You will be notified of our video, especially when we post our skydiving video. Courtesy of GoSkydive.com. So check the description box and we will post the link below. And you can check their website so you can enjoy it. And maybe one day if you leave around the area or if you're somewhere here in the UK you would want to try skydiving so you can visit their website and enjoy it yourself yeah yeah thank you so much keep watching our videos for more adventures thank you for watching our video bye, bye.